How to render using shave in a haircut with Arnold. The shave extension for MTOA allows you to render shave in a haircut hair in Mida with Arnold. Using shave in a haircut with Arnold. First, ensure that both shave in a haircut and Arnold MTOA are installed correctly and both plugins are loaded in Mida. Next, create a scene with some basic geometry and lighting. Remember you will see nothing in an Arnold render without some lighting. Select the geometry and then choose Select New Hair from the Shave menu. Select a type of hair from the Shave and Haircut Shave preset window that appears. Then, make sure Arnold is set as the current renderer, and start the render. You should see your geometry rendered with the hairstyle you chose. In the picture below, a sphere was created, a directional light added, and Shave's grass preset was selected. Any changes you make to the hair, such as altering the color, will be visible in your next Arnold render. If you use IPR, you can see the results of any changes you make instantly. Usage Notes The extension translates a Maya Shave Hair Node to an Arnold Curves Node. There is no special operation needed to render a Shave Node with Arnold, but it is possible to customize how the Shave Hair Node is translated to Arnold. Custom attributes are added to the node for Arnold Visibility, SSFs, Shading, Curves Parameters. These attributes are accessible in the Node UI under the Arnold tab. The Arnold tab, as shown, will not be visible for the hair node unless the shave and a haircut extension has been installed correctly. Override hair. This attribute indicates whether you wish to override the default hair shading with your own shader, which you need to specify via the hair shader attribute. Hair shader. This attribute allows you to connect your own shader to be used instead of the default hair shading, if you wish. The shader will only be used if override hair is set. Note that the custom attributes added by MTOA to the shave hair node are also added to the hair system node for the Maya hair support. Limitation, the user interface for the override hair shader attribute, AIH hair shutter, is not yet fully functional. It is not possible to drag and drop a shader for the hair shader in the attribute editor. Instead, connect the hair shader using the connection editor. Visit garagefarm.net and register. To get $50 credit for a test shave and a haircut render. With all features enabled and without any commitment.